Look! Oh! Mimi! That's Kyrie from Colony Gamma! What? Friend of yours? Yes! But the story will have to wait. Okay. Let's give her a hand. We've been spotted. You're not hurt. Me? Kyrie. Mio! You're in one piece. Thank you so much for saving me. I'm so glad you're alive. Yes, yes. No need to get so excited. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'll calm down. Deep breaths. What are you doing here, Kyrie? Colony cameras. Oh, well, actually. You got separated from your unit again. I'm so sorry. I just have no sense of direction at all. Never change, Kyrie. She's interesting, isn't she? Interesting, a pain in the neck. Same difference, I suppose. So, Mio? Other people. Don't worry about them. They're my friends, and they helped save you. Ah, so they did. Thanks again, Mio. Why, thanks, Mio. Well, the rest of us are mistake. Leave it. That's just Kyrie. Mio, let's hurry back to the colony. I bet the commander will be pleased to see you too. Yeah, about that. Can I have a quick word? Of course. What about? This is an odd question, but... Well, how do we look to you? Ah. Oh. How do you look? Well, let me see. You can't just change your clothes as you please. That's against regulations. Hmm. Now, they suit you so perfectly. I mean, your officer outfit suited you to a T as well, but I mean... Thanks, Kyrie. That's all I needed. Happy to help. I just need to discuss something with everyone. Mind waiting? No problem. in her right mind anyway. No glowing iris. Just classic Kyrie. But does this mean we don't look like hostiles to everyone? Let's not worry about that for now. What should we do with her? That's the question. I want to take her back to the colony if we can. But can we? We can't send her out on her own. It's dangerous, and she'd definitely get lost again. Fine with me, but would she be okay hanging out with us Kevesi? It's possible that the commander of Colony Gamma would hear us out. At least, he isn't the type to turn around and capture people without warning. Can we trust him? Better than the Consul. Trust me on that. If both of you are willing to go that far, then he seems worth meeting. Thank you. If anything happens, I'll do everything I can to keep you all safe, I promise. Thanks for waiting. Let's go, Kyrie. Ready, Mio?
Wait here. I'll go ahead and tell everyone. No, Kyrie, just wait. Hey, guys, Mio's come back. Tyon and Senna, too. Welcome back. We were so worried about you guys. Good job sticking it out, Senna. We were pretty sure you were dead. Foots, why do you have to be so snarky about everything? All of you. I'm so glad you're okay. Mio, it's been so long. <laughs> hmm? Wait, are those actual tears? Uni? <laughs> Snuff it, you big dummy. Our teach. Mio. Senna, Tyon, you're... It's wonderful to see you again. I'm truly sorry, Commander Teach. We never meant to... The details can wait till later. I'm sure you'd appreciate a rest, no? I imagine getting here was by no means a simple task. Am I right? Yes. We appreciate your concern. And as for our visitors here... We can make our introductions later. Hmm. Well then. He was kind of strange. Quiet. But I could feel something threatening in him. Yeah, are you sure about this? He didn't even question us. Perhaps he's already worked it out. Decided we're not hostile. Well, no one's attacked us. Which is more than we can say for... pretty much every other time. Mimi, once we're rested up, how about we tour the colony? Good idea. I want to see how everyone's doing. And we can show the Kabesi folks around while we're at it. Much obliged. We are just visitors, after all. I want to have a chat with the soldiers, too. There are a couple of things I'm curious to know. So this is your old colony, Mio. Let's see what kind of place it is. Good to add more names.
Good to add more names. Better make sure we're well rested. Mmm, delicious. Whew, I couldn't eat another bite. Can't wait to see how Manana prepares it. Could you all come round for a second? Could you all come round for a second? Break time's over. to add more names. Let's make the most of our break, guys. Could you all come round for a second? Looks like our friends are doing just fine, Mimi. Seems so. Still, there's a lot fewer soldiers here than I expected. <laughs> a lot of the soldiers employed on that mission haven't come back yet. No one knows what became of them. The mission where we became Ouroboros, yeah? I dare say that's the one. Sorry. Should have kept my mouth sh No, you didn't do anything wrong, Uni. All the soldiers left in the colony are newbies, with no combat experience. Right now they've been ordered to stand by as a reserve force, far from the front lines. A good thing too. That's what saved Kari and others' lives. Plus, they didn't get to learn the truth about us and the world. But... Ugh. It doesn't sit well with me to pretend like everything's fine, though. Mia, would you mind talking to this commander of yours, Teach? About what? Everything. Tell him thanks for taking us in, no questions asked. Now look, I know I said he was trustworthy, but... No, Noah's right. I was planning on telling him everything anyway, and if we're gonna talk, we may as well lay it all out sooner than later. We can't just expect people to trust us while we hide the truth like this. Yeah, makes more sense than staying and hiding. <sighs> right. The commander will understand, I know it. He's crazy harsh, but crazy fair, too. Harsh? He didn't look it. Sometimes ignorance is bliss. Ah, how is everything? If you still need to rest, then... Commander, there's something else I'd like to discuss with you. Of course. You don't look like you've come to just deliver a report. Then, shall we relocate? That should be... Yes, that would be helpful, thank you. Ah. Yes. I know a good place nearby. 
Let's talk there. What? C Commander, please. We don't need to go there. It has a beautiful view, and a particular peacefulness about it. How lovely! I'd love to see it. This is bad. This is all going south. It's just a change of place. I don't get what the problem is. Oh, we'll regret this. I'd rather not delay, but unfortunately I have some work left to do here. Wait for me next to the training ground. I'll meet you as soon as I can. Uh, very well. We'll see you there. They were outstanding soldiers. I'd go so far as to say they were the pride of Agnes. So, now they're traitors. People are mysteries. You can never really understand them. Don't you agree? But, I'm the commander. I can't let my personal feelings get in the way of my duty. I will deal with them. You can leave the matter with me. We can't afford to ignore anything that might do our very world harm. Huh. Whoa, check this place out. This way, everyone. Here we go! Keep that up, everyone. You've all good heads on your shoulders. Uh, this is strictly first time I'll have stuff for us. <sighs> Are we... Are we there yet? About halfway now. Not long to go. We have very different ideas of what not long means. Come on, people! This is why you need to lift more weights! Senna, you know you can't hone your endurance just by lifting weights. Oh, are you sure? The key to training is working the whole body rather than focusing too much on any one exercise. I'm sure it's not a problem now, but keep it up and you'll wear yourself out. Oh, wow. I see. Hmm. Not good, though. I believe I already taught you this in the past. <laughs> I'm sorry. Look at you, all calm and cool. Indeed, because I train properly. <sighs> this is harder than I expected. I said we'd regret this. The commander is also the colony's instructor, after all. He seems mild-mannered enough at first glance. But new recruits are terrified of him. They'd rather face a battle than his wrath. Uh, Tyon, are you okay? You shouldn't slack off on your training, just because you've seen real battle. Huh. 
Whether you live or die on the battlefield is determined by how you face it. That's where it ends. Excuse me. I didn't mean to lecture. You never change, Commander. Ah, don't embarrass me. You really do come across as an instructor. <laughs> I'll take that as a compliment. It's pretty unusual for a commander to be an instructor as well, though. Probably. In my case, well, there's a lot going on. What do you mean by that? Just what I said. Anyway, break time's over. Let's crack on. Don't say that! What do you think? A good place, isn't it? It's peaceful, invigorating, a place to quiet your mind. Even the war between Agnes and Kevis feels a world away from here, doesn't it? Yes, it does. I assume you know about the state of Colony Gamma. Yes, that's actually what I wanted to... Then I can tell you that you don't have to, Mio. What do you... Don't you get it yet? I mean that I'm going to deal with you here and now. What? But you... Purging the traitor Ouroboros from our ranks is a matter of the highest priority. I am the commander of Colony Gamma. I cannot shirk this duty. Do you understand? What? That you lured us out here to do us in? Yeah, I'm up to speed, thanks. No one in the colony will learn what you are. Understand that the fact I'm not doing this in public is a sign of my respect for you. But, Commander, wait! Please, just listen! What would be the point? Words blur truth and lies so easily. Commander! Ah! We've got no choice! Are you prepared? Face your deaths with honor. The time has come. can't take him down and he's just one guy. I knew he had stamina, but this is... You two display impressive power. But it's that power which is the cause of everything that's gone wrong. Threatening the lives of others as well as yourselves. N no, you've got it wrong. We... No, 
This isn't something that only concerns you. This power is a maelstrom that surrounds the world. A maelstrom eventually becomes a raging torrent that swallows lives without mercy. If you really know what's going on in Colony Gamma, then you must understand this. That's... So, tell me, Mio. Was it the power of becoming an Ouroboros that drove you to the other side? Were you reduced to merely one part of a maelstrom? No, you're wrong! And what precisely am I wrong about? We became Ouroboros by pure chance. But we thought that with such power we'd be able to do more. Ha! Do what? Keep the world alive. Find new ways to use our lives for... I don't know. I can't put it into words. But that's what we want to use it for. That's all I'm sure of. Very pretty words. We can only... We can only go forward. We want to find a way that doesn't involve sacrificing lives. Looks like I've misjudged. What? Well, you've heard for yourself. I don't believe they are traitors. In my capacity as commander, I judge them not deserving of death. Are you in agreement, Consul? The Consul's here. So this is where you are hiding. What a lovely fiction. Bravo. The fact remains. Ouroboros will destroy the world. But that's just one possibility. Still, people can change. I choose to believe them. Like the old you? Yes. I had no will, no resolution. Only shame. But they aren't me. They will walk a different path. You shall persist no matter what. Gave me a chance to fix it. I have an obligation. So let's stop doing things your way. Let's end that here. Very well. Then I shall make you and the traitors recant your folly. Power of Mobius! Commander! Right, you lot. Time to walk the walk. Prove that this power leads to light. We will! Eyes over here! Okay. 
Okay, Neo. Show me what you've got. Commander, we... Not yet, Mio. What? It's not over yet. There's one thing you still have to do, isn't there? There is. Let's go back to the colony and decide our next steps from there. Here we go! Commander, you knew from the start. Not at all. I was serious, Mio. I was ready to die to take you down. So what you mean is you were testing us? Such power can drive people mad. I needed to be sure about you. I needed to know that you hadn't fallen into the trap of being enthralled by power that you had retained your own will. So that's why you had to try to kill us for real? Determining the true nature of power is a kind of power in itself. That's how I do things. You're surprisingly violent. But just one slip and you'd be... I once got to see how power can destroy a person up close. I knew a soldier who was lost in it and lost to it. I don't want to see that happen to you, nor does anyone in the colony. It was no choice at all to put my life on the line to prevent it. You're right that being an Ouroboros comes with huge power, but it's full of danger, too. Yeah, but we're fine. We use it right, so... The reason I became an instructor was to teach people how to confront power. But... There was always a niggling doubt at the back of my mind. That people are at heart stupid creatures that power makes a mockery of. That's... But if you were to ask me whether I still thought that way, I'd say no. So you have hope? I do. 
Now that I've crossed blades with you, I understand. So, the Maelstrom hasn't become a raging torrent, but a clear, strong current. Commander, if that's what you think, then I'd like you to come with us. Oh. And may I ask why? I want you to see with your own eyes that your faith in us isn't misplaced. You want something from us. More than just words, right? Yes. The stream becomes the flow of life itself, bringing change and upheaval to the world. And you want me to be the one to watch over your futures. That's it, isn't it? Yes, well, something like that. Hmm. Okay then, I'll do it. I accept the job. But what have those of you from Kevas to say on this matter? Yes, of course. The more the merrier, especially if they're as strong as you. Fine by me, assuming we never have to fight it out like this again. Well, that all depends on how well you train, doesn't it? Oh, why? <laughs> I was only joking. <laughs> ah, before I forget, Mia. I'd like to ask you a favor in return for this. Anything. Thank you. I'll run through the particulars later. Oh wait, I actually know a very good place for talking. It's just... Yeah, yeah, I think I'll pass on that part. possible.